Hey guys, it's Vinny91, and I'm continuing my series of how to off meta, and today we're talking about Twisted Fate Top. Now, Twisted Fate is usually just seen as a mid. In fact, I'm pretty sure that's basically all he's seen as. But Twisted Fate can actually to top lane pretty well, uh, in the right circumstances. But to do so, you do have to play him a little differently, I believe, than you may ha play a mid Twisted Fate. But before that, let's go with the runes. Now, these are the runes I would go with. And before I go on, the fourth rune, it really depends on who you're facing. If you're facing a tank, then you go with Cut Down. But if you're not facing a tank, then I would go with Coupe de Grace. But these are just runes I would recommend. Items. Well, there are only two items that I say really are needed for TF Top because you have to play them a little differently. You have to play them slightly tanky, in my opinion. So the two items that you really need are Immortal Shield Bow and Hullbreaker. This will allow Twisted Fate to have a good amount of attack, but also to have some defense. And the shield that Shield Bow gives, man, that really helps Twisted Fate a lot, especially since it sometimes gives him time to either kill the person or maybe get another stun card out, you know? So I think these are the only two that you really need. The others, that's really up to you. Play style. Well, Twisted Fate, you have to play what I would call passive aggressive. Now, not whatever that means in psychology or whatever, but. You have to kind of, if they come close, definitely just go after them, keep going, and then back off. You got to kind of go hit, hit, don't get too close, hit, 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 and then when they get low, you can go in, but not beforehand. You got to kind of just got to annoy them for a bit, I want to say, until they're low enough to actually go in. Now, once you get like Shield Bow and Hullbreaker, depending on who's ahead, I do believe you can then start to just go in as TF. I mean, I'm pretty sure I've done it because... Once you have those two, he becomes a, kind of like a slightly different fighter. Sometimes he could even surprise people because people will sometimes come in thinking, oh, this is Twisted Fate. I'm going to come in and beat him up. And then all of a sudden, Twisted Fate can survive a one-on-one -on -one fight with them. Bonus. This version of Twisted Fate actually makes a really good split pusher. Like, he can take out those towers and waves really quickly. So, let's summarize. One, runes. Press the attack is what I would definitely go with. Items. Immortal Shield Bow and Hellbreaker, those are the only necessary ones, I believe. And finally, playstyle, passive aggressive. Now, just to let you know, there are certain heroes I wouldn't play this against, like Trindamir, maybe Quinn. But if played correctly, Twisted Fate can handle most top laners, I believe. But what do you guys think about top Twisted Fate? Have you guys tried this? Would you guys want to try it? Am I an idiot for even bringing this up? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.